Okay, so in this problem, a group of people are going to a Pacer game. And they tell you how much the student tickets cost, because they're a different value than adult tickets. Students are $12, adults get in for $30. They also tell you the total amount spent and the total number of people that are going. And it asks you to find out how many students are in the game. So let's just go ahead and let that be our var variable. X is going to be the number of students. So we need to find a variable for the number of adults too. Well, if the number of students go is X, then if you subtract that amount from 98, what's left over has to be the number of adults. And so you've got to do 98 minus X is going to equal the number of adults. So the number of students is X, and then 98 minus X is the number of adults. So we, we can go ahead and look at this. And we can write an equation for the value of these tickets. The number of, of student, uh, students is X, and so 12 times X, that's how much money they spend on student tickets. And then we can multiply 30 times 98 minus X, and that's how much they spend on adults. $30 times the number of adults equals the amount spent on adults. And then when you add those together, that's the total amount spent. So 1446 Now we can go through and just simplify by using a distributive property. So we've got to do 30 times 98, which equals 2940. And then we've got to do 30 times negative x, which is a negative 30x, equals 1446 we can add like terms, so you're going to get a negative 18x when you do 12 minus 30 plus 2940 equals 1446. If you subtract 2940 from both sides, you're going to get a negative, so if we subtract 2940, you're going to get a negative 18x is equal to a negative 1494. So to solve this, we just divide by negative 18, and we get x equals 83. So we just found out that there were 83 students that went to this game. If you wanted to know the number of adults, you just plug 83 back into here. 98 minus 83 is 15.